So obviously World War II was hugely influential on Beachhead. This is Ernie Pyle. He was an Associated Press correspondent, maybe the first embedded journalist uh, in World War II. This book was influential to the story and the character of Beachhead. This is Robert Kappa, who aesthetically inspired Beachhead uh, substantially. His photography from World War II, especially the D-Day photographs as shown here. Um, the grittiness and the raw uh, sort of front lines uh, coverage was influential to the aesthetic of Beachhead, which uh, tried to replicate a bit here with the flashback sequences, the 16 millimeter. It's fairly gritty and grainy. Uh, this is uh, some American GIs unloading in Vietnam era, and I uh, replicated that a little bit with um, the beach invasion. Um, this is uh, Holland during World War II, uh, just a city just decimated that I uh, replicated with the Hamlet sequence using that back wall as uh, uh, just a prop to cut off the amount of props that I had to create. A uh, standard European train bridge, uh, replicated that with um, the popsicle stick bridge that I built here. Um, some American GIs unloading onto the beaches in Normandy in uh, World War II. Um, I used this sequence as a reference for this sequence, which was um, uh, just as the recon team are waiting for Sarge uh, and about to head out onto a mission and some green screen uh, matting uh, composite matting there and uh, voila you've got a uh, nice little match up where is Bond?